Hi YouTube, welcome back for the Transformers review and this time it will be the uh, Quill Fire from the RRG 2015 lineup. The robots in disguise, not the old robot in disguise, new one. And he is a Decepticon and he is a Hammer or a 4x4, I'm not too sure what the name is. Alright, and here his basic color is beige and dark brown. Alright, as you can see here, he is a deluxe class uh, version of himself. And here are his colors, and the basically the uh, uh, wheels are on a and on plastic, which you can take it out or snap it into it. Just uh, this is basically that. Here's the uh, overall view on him. There's no Decepticon logo on the outer side of uh, of him. Here's the underside. That's where you see the uh, a bit of robot cable, the, the legs. Uh, you can't actually see the hands. You guys, sorry, the, I mean the feet. All right, and you can see the uh, Autobot logo. Uh, Autobot, sorry, the uh, Decepticon logo, which you can uh, basically scan into this uh, the uh, game. All right, and for compar size comparison, here's another. Uh, the Ducks class char uh, character. Uh, basically, this is from the uh, Generations line. Alright, and this is the uh, basically the uh, how it he scales together with the uh, in uh, vehicle mode with uh, for him. Alright, here's a side view, back view, and that. Alright, and. He is basically uh, a, a very very nice new mole. Uh, he's a, he is basically the latest wave of deluxe classes that has to be released. Uh, la uh, basically, uh, this uh, last year. All right. In order to transform into robot mode, move the feet out. Move the feet out. <coughs> All right. What you need to do next is unpack this. Unpack this part here. Fold this up. Then uh, right now you can see the feet. Fold the feet down this way. But first, take this out. This is the uh, storage uh, where you put the weapons in. Right here. And this is a quill fire gun. It's uh, is basically uh, molded in uh, dark uh, brown. And it's actually very uh, cartoon accurate. All right, and turn this, turn his uh, hips over here, and you have the uh, legs transformed. Next, what you need to do is come to this section here, pry this open, and also the arms. Just unpack this over here. Unpack this over here, and basically. You need to fold uh, the hands out. You need to fold the hands out over here. Position it this way. Okay. After that, what you need to do is basically come to this side here. Fold this up properly. Fold this back and collapse this part here. Fold this in, I mean collapse this part here and pack it in, you know, pack coal here. And what you need to do is come over here, just open this up, fold the head out, and close it in again. Alright, and let's fold this right back, just like this, fold this up. And you have basically Quill Fire transformed in his uh, robot mode. All right. All right. Uh, it looks like I have a transformed Quill Fire. Here's the back of him. The front of him, back, sides, and back. And here are the, the uh, quills that he uh, used against Autobots as weapons. You can actually take this quill off. Or you can put it back here. 
it, this is made out of soft plastic this is hard plastic all right and uh, basically for his um, face scalp here's a closer look at his face and his jaws does open and close all right you cannot rotate his head uh, his uh, shoulders are on a ball joint you can rotate a 360 here's an uh, elbow articulation as well you can swivel the elbow here this bend at the elbow and the uh, basically wrist just fold in and it's uh, basically molded on you can't do anything much yes it is articulation and also the upper thigh is on the ball joint and you can swivel the leg this way and you can bend it at the elbow and also the feet just rotate up and down all right and let me uh, let me uh, put the weapon on quill fire and here you are and then this is basically the uh, quill fire from a robots in disguise all right here's a closer look at him on the side here's the back and uh, that's all for uh, the review of quill fire it's basically a short and uh, basically uh, interesting uh, new mold that uh, just came out not long ago and let me bring another character usually compare uh, in uh, robot mold here's a, another deluxe from the generations line all right and here's a side view of him as uh, of course this character is basically uh, a lot taller than Quillfire. All right, playability wise is uh, actually much better, and it's it's quite worth it to get him. All right, and here's a closer look at him again. Okay, and if you do not want the quills to be uh, move this way, you can actually move it down a bit slightly like this and you can fold it in like this so to hide the quills but you will actually see the backpack as well but however usually you just move this up and then fold this back in alright then and this has been a review of quill fire and stay tuned for more reviews coming your way this is Schoolboss2008 signing out